Hello YouTube, welcome to Oman Garden Fix and Tricks. I'm Nikal. In today's video, I'm going to talk about the Nylite 60 watt LED um, spotlight floodlight combo that I bought from Amazon. I bought it for $22.46 at the time of making this video. So, alright, um, let me give you a, a little backstory as to why I purchased this light. Over there is my Mazda. Her name is Cleopatra. It's a Mazda 2. It's a 2008 Mazda Demio. That car, the headlights are not so bright. At night, trust me, you struggle to see the road. So I said that, you know, I was going to change them and upgrade to a brighter set of headlamps. However, I said it's a cheaper alternative to just get some, some um, fog lights slash, you know, flood light on the front of the vehicle so that I can see better at night. And that is, after, of course, deal with safety and everything. So I was searching on the internet and I came across this brand that is called Nylite, right? And um, went ahead and purchased it. Watched some reviews and all the reviews, well, most of the reviews were positive on the product. And so therefore I decided to get it. It's reasonable. And also I'm going to go through it and show you what comes into the, in the box. So of course, have your, your literature there. You have the two lights. So you have the literature right there, you have to put the, um, the stapler on it. Also got that stapler as well off Amazon. Very nice tool. So you have the two lights. And as I said, they are flood spotlight combo. And then you have the wiring harness. So the wiring harness comes with your relay. There's a relay there. You have your negative terminal negative connection um, connection for the for the terminal you have the positive connection it is fused so there is a fuse in it um, this part of it now is the switch that goes inside the car for you to turn on the light all right and it also have a connection right here that you can disconnect it in, in case something went wrong I need to disconnect the switch or change the switch or update the switch you can do it right here um, over here now you have the connection for the two lights so left and right and then you have the mount these are the mounts in the bag for the for the lights itself the light comes um, this um, mount connection right here so they are going to mount on the vehicle like that it should mount on the vehicle like this all right so this is the bag with the mounts and it's very good hardware it's high quality really high quality guys looks to me like stainless steel it did say stainless steel in the description so it's high quality we have some fuse and we have some extra connection right here so we have three fuse so that's it that's what comes in it so it is pretty much a do it a do it yourself type of thing because as i said the entire harness comes with it comes with your relay comes with your connection your fuse your switch already there and the connection for the lights right you just go ahead and connect them and i think that is why they give you these connectors in here so you can solder them onto this and then just connect them onto the lights over there and to the, the harness the wires over there so that's basically it so what i'm going to do now i'm going to go and i'm going to show you where on the car i'm going to put them <laughs> people are so here on it you know i'm going to put it right just so i put in the light them already Put in the wire them already. Can it be positive terminal? No, no, no. Plus more this pan inside of this. Yeah. Right there. I put this. Oh, what? I say I'm going to put it in the relay already. So put it like a bit up though. Take care of this in case I want to pull that. So we run the wire inside the vehicle. Strictly plug and play still now. One, two, guys. Come with everything. We have, have the wire coming in already. We're going to put the switch right there. This is the light switch inside of the car. Of course, this area was there where a blank switch could have gone, gone and we actually utilized this area. So all you do now is just turn it on like that. 
And once you turn it on, there's a light comes up in it. You can see it. All right, so the light there. So it's on now. Off. On. So let's go outside and look at it. I'm telling you, the lights are bright. You're not going to see it in the day, but I'm still going to show you them. See them? <laughs> They're absolutely bright, believe me. Bright. I can just imagine tonight. The night light. And these are 60 watt. Spot and flood. Believe me. They're bright. See them there? We're going to go out in the night and see how they perform. Stay tuned for that. Hi folks, trust me, it's like a night and day difference. This is with the night light off, this is with it on. Whole lot of light, especially over on the left, which is good. This is with the bright. So the bright, the bright of the headlight doesn't even make sense. doesn't even make sense so that's a regular dim bright dim bright and this is with the night light on night and day night and day absolutely bright yeah for just 26 dollar it's worth the upgrade compared to the um, 131 dollar for each of the headlamp so I say it's a good buy. It's a good and buy. It. It's just gonna uh, depend on how well it, it hold up. But I know it going to hold up because as I said, I watch reviews and they said it hold up. So this is it. And as I always say, it is not in, in gathering the most, but is in sharing the most that the most is received. For Oman Garden Fix and Tricks, I'm Nika. Peace.